Pujari. Uh, I'm from Udaipur. I'm working with art from past 18 years. That is something which we have been doing from 1652. Miniatures are very important paintings done in this region. As we are in Mewad, this school of art is called Mewad School. This is the only indigenous and vivid school of arts and miniatures in the whole country. Miniature is not about the size. It is all about the details. There could be a miniature which could be two feet by three feet or even bigger than that. And depending on that, it can take from 10 days to a year to finish one painting by an artist. The uses of the painting and the subjects have changed with the period and need and demand of the people and the Maranas, which were the patrons of the art. Uh, paintings were done as devotional paintings in manuscripts, paintings on Hindu epics, paintings on stories, paintings on melodies of music, ragas and raginis. Paintings are made with special colors made from minerals, like the white is made from zinc oxide. A very special color is made from cow's urine called gauguli. The black color is made from galena. The red is made from red oxide. Yellow from sulfur, blue from lapis lazuli. So they all are mineral colors and they never fade. The brushes are very finely brushes made from squirrel hairs. In most of the paintings done in Udaipur, you will find that the artists have depicted the city palace, the mountains around it, the streets, the important places which are in the palace like the Gangor Ghat, the Selyoki Badi, the lakes like Lake Pichola and all these. You see many paintings done in the 16th century, 17th century in which the Gangor festival has been depicted. You see the procession of the king, you see the procession of the ladies carrying the Gangor figures on their head. And when you see the Gangor festival live, you see that the same festival is still practiced and uh, it has maintained its tradition. We invite you here to come and uh, have a hand with us in doing miniature paintings and be a part of the 500 year old traditional art of Mewat.